If you're a new player looking to dive into Path of Exile for the first time, here's a list of five builds that'll help you to have the best first possible experience in Ray class. And even if you're an experienced player, each of these builds are still great options for League starters. By the way, if you're a new player, I'm gonna be referring to a tool that we use called Path of Building. This is a program we use to work on and share builds. In the description, you'll find a download link as well as a guide from Zizarin on how to use it. With that out of the way, let's get into it. First up, we have Righteous Fire. This is the top of everyone's list for a reason because it's one of the top performing builds of all time. And Pox's guide is hands down the most comprehensive guide without question. The idea behind this build is that you cast your Righteous Fire, which is like a burning circle around you. You just run through monsters, they all explode. And then when you get to a boss, throw some fire traps on it. It's very easy to play. Not only that, it's very cheap, it's very tanky, and most importantly, it's a lot of fun. It also doesn't require much manual targeting except for when using your fire trap and it doesn't use too many buttons. If I could suggest only one build for a new player to start with, this would be it. The video guide is great and there's a full written guide up on PoE Vault. And on top of that, the build has its very own website. Have a read through these resources if you wanna get a crash course on this build. Next up, if you're a new player who likes living out their bow-wielding hero fantasy, Arrows I Shot Deadeye has you covered. This guide is very new player friendly. It includes a very comprehensive hand-holding written guide, as well as a full leveling guide from one of the game's best speedrunners, Tai Tai Killer. Arrow also told me to let you know that he is very handsome, which is another reason you should play this build, but this one looks like a lot of fun Bow builds are genuinely one of the best, most fun archetypes in PoE. So if you're a new player, you want to play bows, give this one a shot. Now, if you're looking for a more involved playstyle, Zizarin's Explosive Arrow Ballista build is a very well-rounded, tanky totem build capable of completing all content in the game. This build has a very smooth playstyle with very few downsides that many other builds face. As a new player, if you want to explore all aspects of Path of Exile comfortably without having to try multiple builds, this build can do it all. The video guide goes through all aspects of the build so you'll know how to play it as well as all of the mechanics that make this build function. The Path of Building guide is also very thorough and on top of that, Zizarin said he might do an everything explained let's play where he plays a full playthrough of the build while explaining it. Now for players wanting to enjoy a more spell-based gameplay, Anime Princess's Spark Inquisitor has you covered. The playstyle for this build is very easy on the hands. It requires no aiming, so you don't need to click on any enemies to hit them. You just push the button, your spell flies out, and whatever's there is gonna get hit. The video guide is also very honest and very comprehensive with Anime Princess explaining all aspects of the build in great detail over this almost hour long guide on the build. His channel also includes a playlist with videos that cover all aspects of the build. So if you wanna take a deep dive into this spellcaster build, Anime Princess has you covered in every regard. Now, last but not least, I'm gonna be recommending my own build because why wouldn't you? I've done everything I can to make this build guide as beginner friendly as possible. I've included a very detailed path of building that'll carry you all the way from level one up until level 100 if you get that far. I've also included a spreadsheet that includes a leveling guide showing you which gems to take after completing which quests, notes explaining all the skills we use, the different mechanics of the build, what kind of items we need to use. That little spreadsheet has everything. This build is slightly more complex than the previous ones mentioned, but everything you need to know is in the guide. On top of all of that, I have included a full leveling playthrough of the build from Act 1 all the way to maps, and I will be streaming this build on League Start. So if you want to ask me any questions directly, you can do so on my Twitch page, and also you can join our Discord server where there are tons and tons of super helpful people, which is another great tip if you're a new player. Join a Discord. The Path of Exile community absolutely loves helping people. No question is considered stupid 
We've all been here. We all know how ridiculously complicated this game is. So if you're looking for help, you're looking to make some new friends, join a Discord. You're welcome to join mine. It is linked in the description. That is going to be it for this video. Do let me know if you do decide to play one of these builds. I have linked each of the videos I've discussed in this video's description. If you want to find the path of building links, you're going to have to check out those videos. Those will be linked in those videos descriptions. Also, please don't forget to like and subscribe to those channels if you like their builds and leave a nice comment saying thank you to those creators for all their hard work they put into their guide. That's going to be it. Take care, everyone. Stay safe and I will catch you in the next video.